Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Um, we're just going to do a little preview of what we're going to be doing this next week. So we got this in here is some eastern red cedar. Um, it just got kiln dried. So we're going to be rolling this out and planting this up on one side. Um, and whatever's clean, then we'll edge it. And we'll be running it through the molder and making some eastern red cedar tongue and groove for... Whoever needs it and whoever wants it. So we got this uh, white pine right here also listed. As, this is going to be going uh, on Marketplace and we're just going to sell it as is. Um, so they've been sorted out, you know, uh, probably four or five different times already. So there ain't no uh, point keeping it around. They're all different lengths. They're all different uh, quality. Some of them are already planed up. Some of them are... Uh, not free some uh, Have knots in it. They're just miscellaneous boards that haven't left yet. So we're just gonna get these listed on marketplace and sold and then over here we got our um, 1 by 12s by 10 feet um, these top Four or five boards are pretty bad. So we're just gonna um, Probably cut most of that up for kindling to be honest and then uh the last four feet here will save for um, clients for small projects and then um, plane up the rest of it the rest of the way down to three quarters because right now it's seven eighths which one of my clients normally wants so um, the stuff that my client gets is this one inch here that's plain to seven eighths it's a lot nicer quality for furniture and then over here we have a bunch of short pine pieces that I listed and put on Marketplace. So this should be sold this week. And over here we have uh, 1 by 8 by 12 foot and some 10 footers in here. I gotta edge these and then I'm gonna run this through the shiplap machine and make white pine shiplap for a few clients. This won't be enough for the clients, but uh, I have more in the kiln for the next load. So for this next week, we're gonna be sawing some one by 10s by 16 foot out of some of these logs here, and then some one by 10s by 12 foot. Then these beams here, these are for uh, mezzanine, so we're just waiting for a client to come pick them up. He should have picked them up uh, this last week, but hopefully he gets here this week. Everything here was custom cut, so I won't be able to use it except for his order. So if you're new to the channel, please subscribe and follow me for some more sawmill and lumber content.